Hello everyone, I'm Ethical Zombie and welcome back to Gloomhaven. And in today's episode, we are going to take on Fairy Tales. Let's see where it is. Uh, I'm not sure exactly where these are on the map. Okay, there it is. So, um, the only reason we're going to do it is because it is the top one. I think in the next episode, we'll go to the Shrine of Zephyrus as it is unlocked and it's the Craghearts mission. Uh, but for now, let's continue on the main missions. We have a ton unlocked, actually. Jobs, relics, uh, just just one ring. Um, but I think we'll just do Fairy Tale. And uh, it's got imps, which we haven't seen before. And elite cave bears and wolves. So sounds interesting. Kill all enemies in all rooms. Um, again, there is a spoiler in this episode for the bottom left character you see on the screen right there. And I will uncover that character now. Okay, let's go to Fairy Tales. As you head southeast across the marshes, marches, conversation switches to what you have heard from Demon Spine Hollow. Stories of fairies and imps cursing travelers and bewitching their livestock. It all sounds very far-fetched. As you reach the edge of the forest, there is a strange feel to the world. Colors seem more vibrant here, and you catch sounds of fluttering wings. Surely, it's just your imagination. Okay, so we get Boots of Dashing, which add plus three move to a single movement, so a bit better than the uh, boots that we have. Uh, and we unlock Demon Spine Hollow. Cool, let's enter the dungeon. I might have wanted to go to the temple beforehand to get some blessings, but that's okay. Uh, I think we can handle this between the uh, characters we have, which you might be able to see I changed up their skins. Apparently there's skins here, so I changed them up. That's interesting. Uh, so as you pass through a clearing, hounds burst out of the undergrowth, followed by high-pitched laughing. It seems the villagers were right. Imps, we never believed the elders of my clan when they said they used to deal with fairies. Okay, thanks, trainer. Okay, so. Uh, well, the brute's on the right side there, so that's good. And I think I'll have my, uh, oh wow, they're really weak. I think my tink, or my uh, crag heart might just be able to deal with them. Let's see, um... Let's see. How far is it? Uh, so it's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, four to hit them both. I mean, that can just be anything. So I'll use unstable upheaval with his boots to go up and Where's the one that I wanted you to use? Avalanche. Avalanche is a burn card. Maybe I don't do that. Yeah, I don't want to burn. Forceful Storm is also burn. Um, is there an obstacle I can move? Oh, there's one obstacle. Yeah, I could do that. I'll just run forward, move this obstacle over here. Where is it? Mm, clear the way? Yes, clear the way. That's attack two. Um, that's fine. We'll do that. Uh, the Tinker can also try and take care of them. Or can maybe trap the wolves? Well, Ink Bomb, let's see. Um, let's go ahead and Toxic Bolt and Ink Bomb right away. Try and get rid of some wolves. Looks like, that's that's kind of cool. The, uh, the light over there. And then there's a door where I'm assuming there's gonna be elite bears and probably more imps. Uh, so the Brute will step up in front of the Tinker and set up Wall of Doom. So let's go with Provoking Roar, Wall of Doom. 
It's a nice opener. And you will step up next to the brute and start hitting as well. So I'll set up bounce back. Oh, actually, resolute stand and bounce back. That's hilarious because that's a ton of retaliate. Uh, and we will end selection. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, they're moving first. That's very annoying. Sorry, Tinkerer. Hmm. That completely breaks my plan because they move so fast. This is useless right now. So is retaliations. Uh, so I guess a basic attack. That's fine. And we'll move. I don't want to take that damage. We'll move over here. Skip the rest of your movement. Confirm. Heal back up to max. Uh, yeah, and Berserker's turn. Now you... I don't want to set up a wall of doom now. So let's go ahead and confirm that attack. And we will disarm the elite. Yep, that's fine. And then the brute's turn. Okay. Um, not too worried about you taking melee damage. So let's go ahead and move you up to here and then we will move oh I picked the wrong card unstable of people wait how did I pick the wrong card what I have no idea how I even picked the wrong card um, undo that. Let's get out of the wolf's way. And attack some fairies with advantage. Nope. Confirm. Okay, well, it killed one. They curse, and I do not want that. Poor Stim. And look, you're also going to... Oh, wow, you attack target three. Interesting. Uh, okay, now that I'm done with that, let's go ahead and set up an attack. Or a heal, maybe. Nah, I don't want to heal yet. Affect all uh, self and all adjacent allies now. Uh, maybe. There we go. Yeah, let's heal or let's get a little closer and hook gun this uh, this fay or this imp. Cragheart, you. How did I click the wrong card? So weird. Um. So let's use clear the way and I can't really set anything up. So we'll just use that and uh, move. How many move is that? Let's move two. One, two. That'll hit him. That's OK. Let's do it. Uh, brute. Do we set up shield self 
and retaliate and hope that that works this time. And then you are just going to attack. Dazing Wound, Defiance of Death. Add plus one. Uh, no, that's not good. Numb the Pain. Attack three to gain two shield or one shield. Suffer two. Suffer three to move seven. Set up healing. Oh, okay. Let's do Dazing Wound and Blood Pact. Suffer one damage at the start of each of your turns. I am not worried about suffering damage. Okay, thank you for going slower. Shield one. And retaliate. Okay. Uh, now you are going to move up a bit. What's the range of your bottom attack? One, two, three undo that. Let's go ahead and use the hook gun first. Nice. That is a dead imp. And then we will move over here. Or actually, no. We're going to skip movement and skip action and Tinker's turn. Hound now. That's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and shield up all past all that. Oh yeah, yeah, the elite hound was um was stunned. Okay, uh, now you are going to add plus one to all your attacks. Confirm. And then you are going to attack. Uh this sound and stun him if he doesn't die. Okay. And he is stunned. Uh, and I will... Let's go ahead and heal. Actually, let's end the Berserker's turn. That's fine. Now you will move in a, a hex, uh, an obstacle. Confirm to right here. Confirm. And you will ignore. Oh no, there's no shields now. The fairies have, or the imps have shield. Let's go ahead and increase the attack. There we go. That is good. Okay. Uh, and then you can go ahead and step up to the door, but don't open it. Skip the rest of your action. Skip the rest of your attack. And the Kragheart's turn. Kragheart will probably pop the door open and after setting up a bit. Uh, we'll see what happens. Um... So I definitely want my brute to get towards the door. So let's go ahead and plan out how to kill this wolf first. Uh, I don't want to use that. That'll kill her. Hmm. Number of card burns. No. Carterize, no. You may suffer two damage to add to make it attack five, no. Add plus two if it's less than half. That'll work. Uh, so let's do from the brink defensive the defiance of death. And then for you, we'll just have you run forward. Uh, move six. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Doesn't get you quite through the door, but at least you get in the door. And then maybe a, do we have any ranged? Yeah, a spare dagger. Okay, now you will actually open the door. Uh, maybe I have you open the door and just set up backup ammunition.
interesting. Uh, let's do that. Let's have you open the door, set up backup ammunition, and that's it. You're just going to stand in the door and take a bit of beating if needed. Um, and actually, my tinker might be able to just kill this wolf for damage. Could probably just crank bow it. Let's go energizing tonic, crank bow. And let's reevaluate what you're going to do. Because you're going to take one damage at the beginning of the round. This will do four damage. Um, no, I'm, I'm, we're fine. Uh, we're not going to burn crank bow. What we will do is move nice and slow and heal her up. So I need a range three heal. A stamina booster. And then uh, start moving. Definitely want you to move slow, so that's perfect. End selection. Okay, that's fine. We can work through that. Confirm. That's fine. I already knew that was going to happen. Okay, I don't want to use this right now. I want to first move up to here. Skip movement, skip action. Now attack, confirm. And now, now don't waste your heal. Okay, now you will use that plus boots to get. Do, do it. Is it worth it? Is it worth the damage? Kind of don't think so, no. And, um... Oh, no. That's fine. Okay. Let's go and skip that attack. This is a going to be setting up for the next round. That's fine. Okay, so end the brute's turn. Uh, Tinkerer, you need to just heal her up. And get a bit closer to the door. Uh, let's. I, I want you in the back. Let's do that way. That way you can heal through the door if needed. Uh, Craighart, you get to pop open the door. Or should I? Well, yeah, let's do it. Uh, so first thing we'll do is confirm that. Back up ammunition. And open the door. Skip the rest of your movement and the crag hard's turn. Okay, cave bear, you're gonna attack. Oh my god, I did not expect six damage. That's fine. Crag heart, it's a beefy boy. Okay, maybe not that beefy. Okay, please don't attack again. Okay, thank you. Okay, that was a bad idea. Uh, can I? I don't know. I think we can move past. Or I could just pull back. Could. Um, brute. If I go up here, is that possible? Uh, kill one adjacent, adjacent to normal enemy. I think the bear is not normal. So let's go with warding strength, fatal advance. Craghart, you need to get out of here. Um, probably not going to, so let's do fatal advance warding strength. 
earthing clod. Plus one attack? Oh, that's interesting. No, no, I want to get the brute in the front, I think. To kill the wolf. Uh, no. I do want to pull the Kragheart back, though. So maybe Earth and Claude for a basic attack, and then a top forceful storm before running away. And then you will... We'll see what happens, but let's set up warding strength and maybe a sweeping blow. Then you are going to probably run forward and do as much damage as possible. So maybe suffer up to up to three. So one, two, three, four, five. You'll only need to suffer one damage. Which would then give you Uh, one, four, you'd be back down at two. If you have move, if you have fewer, then um, perform an attack too. Oh, that's interesting. With boots, you would be really good with growing rage and boots is pretty good. Um... Go with numb the pain. Get a bit of shielding going. Okay, and Tinkerer need to figure out what you're gonna do, which is probably gonna be heal. Healing and healing. Yes, and selection. Okay, only the hound goes first. Receive a damage. Oh, and you're mobilized okay let's get a little bit of a different angle here and we'll heal you up again yeah I know that burns two cards but I'm not too worried about the tinker or burning cards uh, now you I don't know okay you can move in and skip movement. Confirm. Get you over there. It's still going to move, and it will attack both of us, actually. Uh, and then you... Oh, I pushed him. That was dumb. Okay. Uh, yep. Take that damage. Receive a damage. You will... Add one, undo, one, two, three, four. Oh, maybe I do that. I could burn a single card to do this, but she died because we ran out of cards last time. So I need to make sure that I don't overextend her. Oof. Oh, wait, she can heal five. Oh, that's good. Okay. Uh, so let's do that. Confirm that. Receive three damage. And now you can move. Oh, I could have done one less. Uh, now you will receive... You may suffer two damage. No, heal up first. Now attack the bear. Uh, yes. Confirm. Wait, did it not? Okay, I guess it didn't take the, uh, the heal. 
So let's go ahead and take hide, use hide armor. Are we being cursed? We are being cursed. Receive damage. Okay, very annoying. I think my Berserker is going to go after the uh, Imps. Or my... Oh, you can do it. Um... Oh, I can Piercing Blow to do this. Wait, do I not have backup ammunition set up? Yeah, on your next four ranged attacks, add target one. Clear targets. I don't know. Why is it? It's saying that I need to choose my... Oh, weird. Hmm. I don't know why it's doing that. Um, it's fine. That will disarm them for the next round. So confirm. Good. Okay. Now the bear's disarmed and he won't be able to attack. So let's go ahead and heal up my... Oh, do I heal her? Yes, I'll heal her. And in the Craghart's turn. Okay. Um, so you need to just step up a little bit and perhaps Crankbow? <laughs> uh, yeah. All of their discarded cards. Ooh, that would be very good for the Cragheart or for her. Maybe I have her run in. Move three. One. Basically just need her to move one. So let's do that. Uh, that'll be good for now. Then I'll have the Tinkerer. So she's going to move up and attack this person. Um, sorry, she will move up and attack. Uh, probably step back one, two, and get behind the fairy, the imp. One, two, three. Then I'll need my Tinkerer to run in. And, oh, I don't know. So that's a move and attack and a ranged attack and wound. That's fine. Okay. Now the Tinkerer will perhaps set up potent potables and then just uh, move up, move into the room. Craghart, you will use Heavy Swing, Massive Boulder. And you will... Actually, you could deal with... Nah, that's fine. Um, do those two. Let's end selection. Okay. Hi, Cave Bear. Shield, Retaliate, Heal. Okay, I'm not going to attack you this, this turn. Hound, move and attack. Yep, it's fine. Brute. Um, that is not what I wanted to do. Uh, so let's go ahead and take care of an Imp. A uh, Leaping Cleave can kill. Let's grab some money. Skip movement, leaping cleave. Uh, stun powder is probably good. 
Okay, good. At least, at least they are stunned. And let's go ahead and use our healing potion. Is there another door in here? I don't think so, no. Okay, and the brute's turn. Berserker. Yep, take one damage, that's fine. Now you will move three. Where are you? You're on the rock. Let's have you move. Let's have you move back. Okay, then go ahead and attack this one. Nice. Okay. And now, uh, attack one, range three, target two, wound. Good. That is still a wound. Which means they, this one over here dies. And the Berserker's turn. Yep, you took a wound. That one died. Okay, Tinkerer. You are going to... Have you run in and Crankbow? Because you won't take damage. That could be good. You might just be able to kill the wolf straight out. Okay. Uh, you don't need to heal. So let's see if you can just kill the wolf. Yes, you can. End the turn. Okay. Hey, Greghart, how's it going? Uh, let's go ahead and... That kind of is annoying, but that's fine. We'll do that. Add plus one attacks, all ranged attacks. Good. Technically, the bear is ranged. And the imp is ranged. And confirm attack. And it was a curse. That is a dead fairy. No more curses. And the Craighart's turn. Okay. Uh, now... Should have used that on the last turn. Let's see what everybody has left. Pretty much nothing. So let's start with you. Short rest. That's fine. You're pretty low on health. Could have you just run up and punch the bear as much as possible. Yeah, it's a pretty strong attack. Uh, you will do the same thing, so short rest. That's fine. And then we'll have you... So she's going to go 1-2. You can go 1-2. So we'll have you move fast. And what is your strongest single attack? You don't have a lot, but shield bash will do it. Craghart, you will short rest. Yes. Uh, that's fine because I'm going to have you throw. That's actually good. But anyway, I'm going to have you attack with a massive boulder again. Let's do that. Unstable upheaval, massive boulder. And you will... I mean, we might as well just go all in on this, right? Sure. Let's do it. Everyone's attacking the bear. Okay, yep. Confirm action. Take that damage. Uh, now you're going to do even more. Okay, so move this way. Confirm. Do not push the bear. Skip movement. Skip action. Attack the bear. God. Oh, that was so much. Okay. And the Berserker's turn. And now you are going to move up two. 
Yes. And you will attack the bear. Okay, good thing we set up some counter, some alternatives. Um, unstable upheaval. All adjacent allies suffer two damage. All adjacent allies suffer one damage. Let's do consume earth. Confirm. That is a dead bear. Okay. And well, let's grab you some gold. Skip the rest of your movement. And the Craghart's turn. And didn't even need to do that for you. So let's go ahead and have you move up there, grab some gold. And you'll flamethrower this direction. No, you can't. Okay. And Tinker's turn. Seven rounds? Wait, kill all enemies in all rooms is not done. Wait. Where is the... There's a door? Where's... Am I missing something? Oh, there's a door right here. Oh, God. Okay. Um, short rest. That's fine. This is fine. Definitely thought we were almost done. Um, we'll heal. You are going to take a damage, so you need to go slow so you can get healed. Uh, move three, heal self is good. But you'll die if I have you go fast, so... Next four times... Ooh, that's good. Plus two heal, that's probably better. Have you just heal and hang out for a bit? Set up Defiance of Death later, too. Uh, but I definitely need to heal you with the Tinkerer first. Heal three. And... Oh, I have a heal four, actually. But it's not very fast. Let's try and use it. 20 stun shot. Then you need to go slower than 20. So anything other than bounce back is your first card. Uh, let's go ahead and have you move... And uh, I mean nothing. That's a bit of extra healing, so we'll save that for when we open the door. And we'll we'll just yeah, that's fine. We'll discard Carterize. Uh now you are going to move. Yep, hook and chain. Eye for an eye, hook and chain just to get, get you out of the way. Actually, no, not eye for an eye. I don't have another thing I want to use, so we'll just use sweeping blow. And then you will start moving as well. Uh, oh yeah, that works. Clear the way to get you through to the door. And don't use an attack. Uh, let's use Sentient Growth as a basic attack and just waste it. And End Selection. First thing is healing her. No, no, no. That's the wrong one. Okay. Uh, now you'll move this away. Okay, and Tinker's turn. That's fine. I know you're going to take a damage. Uh, now you will move four. And skip attack. And the Berserker's turn. Now you are going to move four. And skip attack. And you are going to move Five. 
and skip attack. And the Kraghar's turn. Okay. Now we're all in the first room again. Oh, man, that's... We're going to run out of stamina. I can already feel it. Okay. Um, should I heal again? Kind of feel like I should heal again. Let's see what what we can do with the brute. If I have him run up three, he needs to be able to move three. Okay, there we go. Leaping cleave. Wall of doom, leaping cleave. Then she can... So if I have him run one, two, three, she needs to get in though. She needs to be able to move one, two, three, four, five. I could have her set up Defiance of Death, I think. Yeah, I'll have her set up Defiance of Death. And uh, we'll heal her a bit as well. Get her in that room and then she can start doing damage. So we'll do Defiance of Death, Numb the Pain, just to get cards out of the way. Uh, then you are going to probably be okay where you are. Earth and Claude could be good because you have backup ammunition still. You have two more. So let's do that and that. And then the Tinkerer will probably heal. May recover all of their discarded cards. Do I want to do that yet? Mm. Okay. If I have the Tinkerer go after her, that would be good. So let's make sure he goes later. One adjacent ally may recover all their discarded cards. No, that actually won't work because she will. Is she gonna move? Let me think. If I ever go last, no, she's not gonna move. Okay. And end selection, end selection. Okay, so you are gonna go first. And you are going to set up Wall of Doom. Mm -hmm. Confirm. Okay, and then you're going to move into the door. Pop the door open and the Brute's turn. Wolves. Are you howling? No, you're attacking. Good. That is what I wanted. And that's fine. Okay, confirm. Yes, you're going to take one damage. I expected that. Now you're going to, on the next three sources of damage that would kill you. And then a basic attack to skip. And the Berserker's turn. And I might pull you back and we can deal with people one at a time and not get cursed, hopefully. Okay, um, you... You, 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 you are going to Earth and Claude. Yeah, okay. So let's move you up to here. Range of Earth and Claude is pretty good. Skip. Earth and Claude. You can attack both of them. You don't have your bow anymore. So let's do that. Nice. Okay. Other one? Other attack? Oh, that's good. Okay. And the crack heart's turn. Okay, now you... Going to have her recover all of her discarded cards. That skips a short rest. And also heal her. Uh, and skip the rest of your turn. Okay. Now, what are you getting... What are you doing? You are attacking and cursing. Receive some damage. Receive damage. Wow, you're 
car your deck is just gonna be all curses. Okay. Oh man, I hate these guys. I think my Kragheart can just start keep can just keep taking care of them though. Let's create some obstacles. And attack. Okay, so you're going slow. Brute, you are going to move backwards. Hopefully they don't go faster than 18. You're going to pull into the, to the room. We don't want to keep getting cursed. So you're going to pull back. Yeah. Then you're going to run forward. Which of these are okay to stand on? Not many. One, two, three, four. Wait, no, close. Don't do that. Maybe I just have you move. Yeah. Then you are going to... Fewer hit points than half your maximum. Yes, so growing. And... And we'll do... Uh, you're not going to be able to retaliate, so let's go with... Attack. Dazing Wound. Okay, so you're gonna go nice and slow. And Tinkerer, I need you to heal. What can you do? So let's go ahead and short rest. Heal and heal. So we have Restorative Mist and Stamina Booster. Do I need you to heal that badly? I kinda do. Maybe I just have you attack. Like, run up and start attacking some people. Flamethrower. That's fine, we'll do that. Okay, so it looks like they are all going to go first, which sucks. Yeah. yeah. Whoa. Oh, holy crap. Shield five, heal one. That is a heck of a card for them. I've never seen that. That is six shields on them. Yep, receive a damage. And you are immobilized. That's, that is just not what I planned at all. Oof. Okay, this isn't going well. And let's heal self. Okay. Um, that's very, very bad. Attack five, but it's bottom attack. Attack two and poison, attack two and pull. I think I'd rather do poison. So let's go ahead and move closer range three, one, two, three, yes. Uh, L. L. 
undo L, line of sight. Okay, yeah, it looks like, looks like he does have line of sight there on that wolf, so that's good. Um, so let's go ahead and uh, move up here. And attack this wolf. And end the Tinkerer's turn. Okay, uh, this I didn't expect. Don't have any ranged attacks set up. So let's just create some obstacles to throw later. And we'll skip the attack. And the Kraghart's turn. Yep, attack yourself. That's fine. Move three. Go and move up. And skip attack. Consume, no, skip. Okay, and the Berserker's turn. Hey, uh, you need to get out of the doorway. Let's hope you can get out of the doorway. And then perhaps I can have you punch something. I, I have no idea. Uh, and then you need to short rest. Earth and Claw, that's fine. Uh, let's do Crushing Grass, Massive Boulder. At least I have options here for moving and attacking. Uh, and then you can short rest and ooh, stamina booster is very good i think i'll redraw yeah okay that's better recover one of their burned cards who has the most burned i think you are the one that is going to need that the most so let's see if i can get you some movement oh no i can't you have to be standing next oh wait an ally within range three. Okay, perfect. Um, so in that case, let's see if I can attack and stamina boost. Okay. Okay, good. Good, good, good. So now let's move to here. Confirm. Set up retaliation. Now he needs to be the best looking target for these people. So let's end the brute's turn. Then you are going to allow her to recover a burn target card. Let's do resolute stand. Or actually, Strength and Agony. Because it's a non-burn card, so that'll last a, maybe a bit longer. Uh, and then I'll let you attack this guy. Confirm. Okay. Now the Drop Wolf needs to... Yep, confirm action. That's fine. Receive a damage. Now you need to run up. to stun an adjacent enemy. Um, let's do it. That's probably a terrible idea. Stun the wolf. And heal yourself. Sweet. Okay, uh, now... I want to move in.
and massive boulder. You clear. Let's actually undo massive boulder. You and you confirm. Wow, that really sucked. And the Craghard's turn. Still got some gold. Yep, three damage. Four damage. Uh, the Elite's cursed, but this one's not cursing, so that's good. Okay, and... What else are we doing here? Okay. Um, now, you don't have much longer, so let's make sure to... Maybe I just have you run in. I'll have you move, too. Uh, actually, Berserker. Let's see how fast you can kill this wolf. So that is five attack. Then I can have you move at least. Now you. Hook gun can attack and move and heal. Then you can run in. And attack with Warning Chain. And do you have it? You do not have another backup ammunition. So let's actually have you Avalanche. No, there's no obstacles, no good obstacles in the way. Uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, you'd have to you'd have to move quite a bit. Um, so instead of avalanche, let's do sentient growth. I can have him sent. Yeah, okay. And and selection. See what happens. Okay. We can deal with that. Yep. Take a damage. Oh. Now you will attack. Consume. Zoom to attack him. Okay, let's clear targets and undo so that I do it correctly. So attack, consume, confirm, receive two, and confirm. There we go. And let's move you up. And skip the rest of your movement. Confirm action. Heal yourself a little bit. Okay, and the Berserker's turn. Now you... I think I want to have you attack. Let's have you move up. Confirm. That's a, It's a tiny heal, but that'll work. And let's have you... There's a chance you could kill this guy. So let's do it. Yep. Uh, and then I can have uh, pull you here. And you might as well heal yourself. Oh, man. Okay, and the Tinker's turn. How many curses do you have? Two curses left. Um, so that's a... Range three doesn't get you very far. Or I can have you move four and try and attack someone. No, no one's going to be in. No one's really going to be in range, so. I'll just have you use hook and chain. Can you attack him from there? No, undo. So in that case, let's go ahead and move you up behind. Skip the rest of your movement and attack this guy. Okay, don't curse. That is a kill. And the brute's turn. Forest imp, what are you doing? 
You are moving and healing. That's fine. I am okay with that. Okay, so for the Kragheart, we're going to uh, probably add plus one, confirm. And I don't have, but at least I can take care of the healing, I think. So let's do that. Okay. It's a nice little heal. Okay, now you are going to short rest. It's fine. And we might as well let you go out in a burst of flames. Sunshot flamethrower. Uh, short rest. You actually have tons of cards left. Now you are going to attack. And attack a lot. Um, strength and agony. Carterize. Bounce back to retaliate. No. You're standing right next to it. So let's see. Um, let's do strength and agony carterize. Then you will. Let's go and short rest you. Grab some cards. Provoking roar. Perhaps hook and chain or leaping cleave. Yes, that's fine. And then you are going to short rest. Heavy swing is fine. Crushing grasp. And sentient growth. That sounds fun. And selection. Nice. You're going nice and slow. Just the way I like it. Okay. You. Actually, I should have had a move three. So let's undo that and let's move three to get you up there. Okay, and then you will attack two and perhaps disarm. Nice. And the brute's turn. Okay, now you are going to run in. to here, grab some gold, skip the rest of your movement, and flamethrower. Do damage. I am happy with two damage. And then the tinkerer's turn. Disarmed and wounded, so that's always good. Now, move two, heal one, attack one, and then crushing grasp, move two, Immobilize. Let's do that. That sounds fun. Yep. Heal two. And confirm attack. Nice. With a muddle too. And then let's go ahead and punch it. That is a dead imp. Okay, cool. Uh, and the Kraghart's turn. I really thought I was going to lose this, but I highly doubt that right now. Um, so. I killed the wrong imp. That's okay. I don't need to take damage. Oh, I used the wrong attack. Oh, no. Um, that's very annoying. Let's grab some gold. And let's wound again. Not that it matters. Yeah, I, I, I definitely did. I meant to do the, the five damage. Which would have been like six damage, actually. Confirm. Uh, and now you are going to... I don't really... Ma it doesn't really matter here. So let's... Everyone just gets to do an attack. A last, one last attack. End selection. Confirm. Okay. 
Uh, that is a ranged attack, which kind of puts a damper on it. I don't want to retaliate. I want to ranged attack, so let's just move. It's going to die anyway. Yeah, it's it was pretty much guaranteed to die. Um, that gold is gone. That's fine. Confirm. Receive damage. Is there any gold I can take in here? Move three? No. I don't see any gold I can take, so let's go ahead and skip movement. Skip action. Top card. Skip attack. And berserker. Uh, you could step on a trap and take some take some gold. Let's do it. Receive some damage. Skip movement. Skip attack. And Crag Heart's turn. Yeah, three gold. Totally worth it. Victory. There we go. With the imp and hounds dead, the colors of the forest return to normal and you head on towards the village. Exit the dungeon. Okay. So, that was a long mission. I didn't see the uh, second door there in the main room. So that's something I'll have to keep out, keep a lookout for. Uh, cool. Uh, I think we're good for the day. So um, thanks for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. And if you want to see more Gloomhaven, make sure to subscribe and hit the little bell icon to get notified of new videos. And I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.